What's up everybody, this is Eric the Tech Preacher. So I'm always talking about Dex. I made plenty of videos about Dex, about how Dex have took my PC-like experience to the next level. I use Dex in my business and I use Dex at home. Or if I'm out and about and I need to run Dex, I always run Dex either uh, with a Bluetooth keyboard and mouse and a monitor, or if I'm in a hotel on vacation, I can plug up a USB type C to HDMI to a, a monitor or a TV and I can get that Dex-like experience. A lot of you guys ask me the question, how do I run Windows 10 on Dex? And I talk about Splash Top. So a viewer of mine asked me, easy, what is Splash Top? And can you go a little deeper and explain what Splash Top is? Splash Top is a remote service software that you can download on your PC and on iOS or Android, and you can remotely connect to your desktop or laptop in a remote location, and you can run Windows 10 or Mac OS 10. It don't matter which operating system that you do you have. But I always run Windows. So uh, I'm a Windows fan. I mean, I've used my Macs every now and then, but basically I always run Windows. So let me show you how I run Splash Top on my devices. Sit back and relax and get your popcorn ready and follow me on this journey. Let's go. What's up guys, this is Eric back with another video. So I always talk about Splash Top. For me, I've been using Splash Top for years to remote log into my business PCs. Also, if I'm out and about, I need to log into my home PC or my desktop. Uh, and I can do that with Dex or if I have my iPad or a tablet and I want to run EXE programs or I need to remote log into my home PC or my business PC, I use Splash Top. Now I'm using the business version of Splash Top, but you can use the personal version of Splash Top and I believe it's about 60 bucks a year. Uh, now it used to be free, uh, but now it's, uh, I think it costs like 60 bucks a year, which we could go into the, uh, the page in a minute. Regardless of that, it works great with minimum lag, and lagginess is all depends on your network. So if you're in a slow internet environment, yes, you will have a very laggy experience with Splash Top. But if you are in a very good environment, as far as uh, internet speed, you will have a seamless uh, experience with Splash Top. So as you can see right now, I'm running Splash Top on my Dex pad. I'm running Dex here. I got my Galaxy Note 10 Plus. I have a Bluetooth keyboard and mouse, and I have a monitor, and I'm running the same thing that's on my PC. So what you're looking at right now is it's I'm remote logged in on my Dex system to my PC, and now at this point, I'm running Windows 10. Now, Windows 10, again, is, I mean, it's Windows 10 is Windows 10 with minimum lag. I can run anything that I want to run here. Uh, if I want to run uh, a full version of Adobe Premiere and edit my videos on the go, I can do that. Now, before I continue, I want to tell you guys that I'm not being sponsored by Splash Top. They didn't uh, tell me to make this video. A viewer of mine asked me about Splash Top. I'm always talking about Splash Top. And I said, you know what? Let me make a video about Splash Top because I'm always talking about how good Splash Top is. I've been using it for years. So I'm not getting sponsored or paid by Splash Top. So let's go into the website and let's see what Splash Top is all about. Splash Top got four different tiers. They got a personal business classroom and enterprise. Uh, if you get the personal one, I believe it costs about 60 bucks a year, but you could get a trial version. And uh, I, I don't, I think I'm being grandfathered in because I've been using it for so long, but I believe it's about 60 bucks a year. Yeah, so solo for one or two, uh, for one user's two computers, about 60 bucks a year. All right, so if you break that down per month, it's pretty much nothing. Uh, or you could become a pro user and 99 bucks a year and you can get into more of the business aspect with multi, multiple computers that you can use at the same time. You have to download Splash Top on your desktop, right? And then you have to go to your app store, whether or not it's iOS or Android, and download the Splash Top app. So once you download uh, the Splash Top on your PC, you have to create a login and that's it. Create a login and password. And once you do that, once you download Splash Top on all your devices, 
you use the same login and password and it will sync with each other and it will see that login and password. Once you do that, boom, you can log in remotely to your desktop or laptop and you can run whatever's on your desktop or laptop. All right, so we know this scenario, right? But what about the phone? All right, so I have a phone here and I'm going to log off a of, uh, splash top here and I'm back into the DEX environment, but I got my V60 here. So I got my V60 and I have splash top on my V60. All right, so once I run splash top on my V60, there it goes. It's logging in automatically because I already did my login password already. And I just click on it and I remote log in and boom, now I'm good to go. So at this point, I am now using my phone as a remote login to my laptop. So now I'm remote log in and I can do anything I want here. Even if I wanted to edit my video, here we go. I got Adobe Premiere Pro running. And again, it all depends on uh, the uh, network speed as far as latency, but I don't get no latency running splash top because everywhere I go at, I got very fast internet. So it's no problem there. And as you can see, I can run, right? I can run Windows 10 on my phone. So right here, I'm running Windows 10. There it is, right? And again, the latency is really good right there, as you can see, no problem. So if I have a good internet connection and I'm running splash top, the speed that you're seeing right here is the same speed that I can run there. But again, since the V60 can use the pen support, I can use the pen to get a lot of work done. And I, if I got a document or folder that I need to email it, I could do it right there and it works great. So there it is, boom. And look at that nice, the, the, the touch uh, sensitivity works great. And there it goes. So uh, now I'm running Windows 10 on my smartphone. So a lot of people ask the question, I kind of made a video about a couple of months ago that you can run Windows 10 on a smartphone. And a lot of people didn't watch the video. So they, you know, called BS on it. And I'm showing you right here. Now I'm running full fledged Windows 10 on a smartphone and I can run Windows 10 on DeX. All you have to do is use splash top. So when you go into settings, all right, uh, so you, you can do a proxy, you can uh, you can do auto, you can do a manual. You, you, if you have a server, you could put the server information in, uh, the username and password and stuff like that. So if you, ha if you have a server and uh, you wanna put that information in uh, with the IP address or whatever, you could do that also. And so you can remote log into your server if you want to do it that way. So it has some unique things that you could do with Splash Top. And uh, I think it's a really good thing. It's a really good experience. And hey, it is what it is. So Splash Top, I give it two thumbs up. I, do, I use it all the time. As a matter of fact, I use it every day. Uh, but I wanted to share my experience about Splash Top. And you can, yes, you can run Windows 10 on a smartphone. Yes, you can, without a doubt. This is Eric from Easy Computer Solutions. This is one of the reasons why I like to make these tips and trick videos. Because people ask me, easy, how could I make my life better with, my, with the phone that I got in my pocket? There you go. College students, enjoy. See you guys on the next video. Peace.